Imagine if Nacho had hair. To work. Okay, Phoebe, where is this dragon? Miss Hands is bringing the dragon in. Wait, is it her dragon? Yes! So that makes her mother a dragon! Miss Hands, come on in! Well, where is this dragon? Right here. Oh, it's a bearded dragon! What's his name? This is Nacho. Oh, Nacho, wait, come back. I need to give you a checkup. Is that why you're here today? That's right, he just needs his yearly checkup. Oh, okay, and wait a minute, something's going on with his skin. And what kind of animal is a bearded dragon? So Nacho is a reptile. Reptiles are animals like lizards, like Nacho here. Snakes, crocodiles, turtles, and tortoises. And they usually have dry, scaly skin. Look under his chin. Some of his skin is coming off. Oh, oh, and that is totally normal. Don't worry, little Nacho. That's called shedding. And Fizzy, do you know why reptiles shed? Yeah, because they're growing. And they need to fit into their new skin. They grow a layer of skin underneath. And then they shed their old skin. That's right, they shed so they can continue to grow. They can't grow if they stay in their tight little small skin. And Nacho's whole body has shed. He just has a little bit left on his chin to shed. Here's a piece from his leg. He just shed this this morning. And here's a crazy fact. Sometimes bearded dragons will eat their own skin. Sounds kind of gross, but there are some nutrients in there. So when he's shedding to help him lose that skin, I give him baths and mist him with a little bit of water. That helps the skin to stay moist and to fall off. And if you want to see him taking a bath, we have it on our channel, Raddest Reptiles. We'll put the link down below. I understand that reptiles are cold-blooded. What does that mean? Cold-blooded means their body is the same temperature as the air around them. Nacho here has a special basking light. He loves to sit under it and soak up the warmth. And sometimes they open up their mouth to regulate their body temperature. It also helps him to digest his food and get all the nutrients out of his food. Oh, what kind of food does Nacho like to eat? Great question, Phoebe. Nacho loves bugs like roaches and crickets oh wow okay anything else that he eats yes most of his diet is leafy greens like collards and dandelion greens he can also eat other fruits and vegetables but just in moderation for example he can eat red bell pepper here you go nacho oh there he goes i don't think he wants to eat red bell pepper right now okay nacho let me just look into your eyes here oh they look nice and clear in your nose Nice and clear. Um, can you say ah? Oh, wait, 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 I need to listen to your heart. Come back, Nacho. Okay, we'll just listen to his heart. Nacho, your heart sounds great. It's time for a surprise for you being such a good patient. Fizzy, whizzy, boopsy, ah. And there are his surprises. Let's see which ones he wants to open up. Let's see if he'll walk back over here. Okay, Nacho, which one do you want to open up? Do you want to open up this one? Or do you want to open up this one? Okay, I think I know what Nacho wants. I think he wants to open them both. 
Let's get started with our Zuru 5 Surprise Unicorn Squad. So what a magical unicorn surprise will we find? Let's open this up. In our first one, we have, ooh, some candy stickers, a pink comb, and more candy stickers. And in our next one, we have, a big giant lollipop, a little purple skirt, and some shoes with a little more candy. All right, here's our next one. What's inside? Yellow fluffy slime. It smells like lemons and it's so stretchy and so fluffy. Look at that, woo! And let's see what kind of unicorn nacho got. It's a pink one. And it has pink and blue hair as its mane. It looks like we got little Cherry. Now let's get her dressed. Here she is all dressed up and ready to eat her lollipop. Okay, what do you think, Nacho? All right, great. And up next we have LOL Surprise Hair Goals. Here we go. By the way guys, imagine if Nacho had hair. Let's keep going. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We have our beautiful barrettes and a secret message. It's an arrow pointing up and a knot. Hey Nacho, what do you think this means? Oh, now guess is Nacho it is. Top knot. Now let's open up our hairspray bottle. I believe this is our little handle in here. Yes it is. And now we will uh, pop open these doors and see what we find inside. Oh, it looks like long, long hair. <gasps> Who's inside? Well, we will find out soon after we open these bags and these hair rollers. Let's start with a roller, whoa. Ooh, we have a pretty little sippy cup. It's pink and adorable. And roller uh, number two is our comb, whoa. We can comb somebody's hair. That's right, <laughs> maybe Nacho's hair. Okay, here we go. We have, oh, look at this outfit. A red and pink checkered or plaid shirt. It looks like little overalls. And in our next bag, it's something very small. It's a little golden wristband. Wow, two more bags. Nacho, are you impressed? Okay, well, here we go. We have, <gasps> Little brown cowboy boots. And in our next bag, hey, we have some cool sunglasses. Okay, it is time to see who is inside. Oh, it's so hard to open, here we go. <gasps> look, look at all this hair. Long, long hair. And we need to go ahead and get this jelly outfit off. Well, it looks like she's already wearing an outfit. Look, she has camo on top and she has black shorts on. This is Twang. She's from the Opposites Club and let's get her dressed. Here is Twang, all dressed up and that long, long blonde hair reminds me of Rapunzel. She looks amazing. Ah, dragon, woo! Oh no, it's okay, it's a beauty dragon. He's totally friendly. Hey, let's bring him back to say goodbye. Hey guys, if you enjoyed seeing Nacho and wanna see more of him, Check out our channel, Radis Reptiles. We'll put the link down below. Check me out on Radis Reptiles. We hope you enjoyed watching me be a 